The Iowa National Guard's 734th Agribusiness Development Team foot patrols through the streets of Asadabad, the capital of Kunar Province. The ADT is making its way through town to the canal that runs through this city and beyond for several miles. The ADT is paying $15,000 to have much of this canal cleaned, a task that is employing 300 workers and 15 supervisors for weeks. Now the ADT is assessing progress on the project with officials from the Kunar provincial government, as the ADT's finance officer explains. We're just uh, validating that they are indeed doing some hard work. There's a lot of... Uh, a lot of sediment that's been lifted out of the canal and put on the sides here. And we're talking with the irrigation director. He's accompanying us and explaining their method, why they do things the way they do, and just kind of doing an overall review of the uh, work that's being done. And this canal is vital to the people of Kunar province. This is a central canal uh, and it uh, uh, also take water to Asadabad Bazaar um, shopkeeper and to, uh, it's a uh, uh, canal take to about 21 uh, village uh, people water or to agriculture this is very important and good. As the ADT continues its foot patrol out of Asadabad, following the canal south of town, an entourage of local elders and government officials walks with them until they meet a large group of local workers. And the ADT's hydrologist is convinced the team is getting its money's worth. I believe we are. I really are. When you look at this dirt up and down this canal, these guys are doing this by hand. They've done a great job so far. Uh, for We couldn't hire people like that in our country to do it, but they're doing it all by hand. Even though it's their responsibility, they're doing something. So uh, my heart feels good about it. The ADT heads back to base, and Holding has this appraisal of what the canal project represents. Victory in Kunar. Captain Peter Shin, Kunar Province, Afghanistan.